Uh, G H I J K are about to board Splash Mountain. They're asked to split into a group of two and a group of three. It's G H I J and K. I've got a group of two and a group of three. Um, and the rules are G and H have to be in the same group, and I and J have to be in separate groups. This is, I want to teach you to seat the assholes first, OK? I've got a group of three, and I've got a group of two. How are they going to divide up? This is super common, by the way. This happens on like almost every test. You end up with a situation that looks a lot like this. Um, if G and H have to be together, it seems like they could go here or here and satisfy that rule, OK? But not when you deal with these assholes. These guys hate each other. They have to be separated. So I can take up one spot in each boat with either I or J, either J or I. I have to separate them. And there's only two groups. And once I do that, now there's only one spot left for G and H. So now G and H have to go in those two spots, which leaves only K. K was the wild card, right? We didn't think K had any restrictions. But because of everybody else's issues, K ends up having to go in that spot. Now, which one of the following must be true? Does G have to ride with I? No, G can ride with I or J. Does H have to ride with J? No, H can ride with I or J. Does K have to ride with J? No, K can ride with J or I. Does I have to ride in a group of two? No, I can go here or here. K rides in a group of two. Yeah, K got forced over here by all of these people with their problems. Remember, if you're making a seating chart for a wedding, you don't seat the person who gets along with everyone first. You seat all of the people with all of their issues and drama, and these people have to be together, and these people can't be together. And then the, you know, your buddy, my buddy Craig, who gets along with everybody. Everybody loves Craig. Craig loves everybody. That's the guy you're going to seat last, because he can ride with anybody. He can sit with anybody. And sometimes that means you're going to know exactly where Craig goes, but only because you've already dealt with all of these assholes and specifically the people that hate each other. That's what really makes it sticky. Follow that? So easy answer for number two.